You're listening to KEXP. We're at 90.3 FM in Seattle, streaming live around the world at kexp.org. I'm Cheryl Waters, and I am so happy to have Kiosmos in our KEXP studios today. Olafur Janus, how you doing? Good. Yeah, we're great. You look great, and I'm so excited well, to hear new you. music. I hear you're going to start off with a couple of new tunes. We are, yeah, from our new EP, Swept EP. This one's called Gaunt.
simply gorgeous. It's Chiasmos in the KEXP studios. Thank you so much. That sounds beautiful. Thank you. And thank you for gracing our new studios here at KEXP. You look and sound amazing in here. It's great to be here. Congratulations on the new space. Thank you so much. It's amazing, actually. Yeah, it's really beautiful. We went to the wrong space, by the way. Today. I heard that. Yeah. We went to the old one. It was hard to leave for us, too. <laughs> but we're happy to be here and so happy that you're here today. And that was two beautiful new songs from your new EP, Swept. And last time we had Kiosmos on the KEXP airwaves, you had just released your full length, Kiosmos. That was in November 2014. And we didn't get a chance to chat with you on the air since that was just a live performance. But I know that the two of you were friends long before you started making Chiasmos. And you actually were playing music together long before you released your first EP. Can you take us back in time a little bit and tell us uh, how your relationship started as friends and how you started making music together? Yeah, um, so I was uh, playing at this venue in Reykjavik called... Um Organ, organ, organ yeah. it was called. and uh, Oliver was the like in-house sound engineer at this time. At this, sort of in like 2007, 2008. Yeah. And my old band used to play there all the time, like every other weekend. And uh, then finally, we made this album and went on a tour around Iceland. And we brought Oliver up along because he already had mixed us so many times. And um, in the tour bus, we kind of discovered we liked this kind of new techno music that was going on back in 2007. It was pretty uh, hard techno back then. Yeah. <laughs> and we, uh, we started doing this with the motto of uh, making techno for people who are tired of dancing only with their feet. <laughs> people should also dance with their hands, you know. Because everyone was so cool back then. They were always just like dancing like this. And we, we thought that was pretty annoying when we went to clubs. So, so we you were inspired to, to try to make them move their feet. Music more like here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Janus, what band was that? Because we're very familiar and yeah, love your band, Blood, Blood Group. Group. But yeah. you've you've been in a number of bands, so that yeah. was Blood Group. Yeah, exactly. I ask because um, you have this beautiful ambient and textured sound with Chiasmos that blends classical and electronic music, which uh, m is brings something from both your projects, your solo project, Oliver and Blood Group. And it makes me think, uh, Oliver, you were dancing <laughs> during that set, and you probably dance more. And Giannis, you probably dance a little less yeah. in Chiasmos. <laughs> <laughs> this is true, actually. I think it's an outlet. Uh, I need it more, you know? I spent so much time sitting on a piano and being still. So I'm curious what your dance. time in the studio is like. Uh, a few years ago, when we were in Reykjavik, we got to see your studio when it was brand new. And uh, what, what's it like when you're making this music in studio? It sounds like there's a lot of instruments on there. But when you do your live show, not surprisingly, it's just the two of you out on tour. Yeah. Um, in the studio, we actually play, like on the new songs, I played drums real drums, so it's not all drum machines. Um, I play piano, Janus plays a bunch of percussion as well. Mm. Um, it's very experimental, it's very much like a live music session. It's not just sitting on a computer software and clicking the mouse, you know. We liked, we like things to be a bit more physical in the studio. When you go out on the road, your music has, well, your music, not when you're just on the road, but always your music has a very cinematic feel, which lends itself to a very visual experience for the listener. And I understand that when you're playing out, you have a very visual element um, to the show. How did you sort of conceive that and put that together? Well, we worked with two really amazing people. One of them is Mauni Sekfusun, who's actually Sing Fang's brother. Uh, he made the video uh, stuff for us, like visuals. And then we work with a light designer named Stuart Bales. Um, who designed the, the light show. And the light show plays a huge part of the show as well. Can you kind of describe what, what it's like? It was just, it's pretty dark, and then the lights just do all the work. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, it's, it's designed to hide the fact that we don't actually do that much. Of it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, it's, um, it's very ambient, it's very kind of beautiful. Like, the colors are very natural. Um, but then at the same time, it's very active. There's a lot of strobes. It's, you know, it's designed to also make you dance. And, but at the, at the same time, it looks like a beautiful light design. Um, so it, I think it's a bit different from the light design from other uh, dance acts. You know. 
And the live show is very different than the experience that you have listening to the record. And that's by design, I understand. That's your well, intention. We, we kind of want people to just come and dance mostly because the album is kind of, you can listen to it in your kitchen and while you're making food or something. But our shows are kind of designed to dance with your heart, you know. <laughs> crying on the dance floor. That's what we yeah. want people to do. <laughs> I love that. It's so wonderful to have you here. It's Kiosmos in the KEXP studios. And I understand you have a song from your last album. Yeah, this is from the debut album. Um, it's a song called Bent.
Discover new music at listenerpoweredkexp.org.